Alrighty, so I'm going to make a quick video on what is the difference between a swing high and an intermediate term swing high. So, for anyone that doesn't know what a swing high, what a swing low is, a swing low is composed of three candles, all right? One, two, three. That's a swing low. That's all you need. Three candles is all you need. Okay. Um, so you got your lowest low in the middle. Boom. And then you got a higher low on the left and you got a higher low on the right. That's all it is. That's all a swing low is. It does not matter where these candles on the left and the right or the middle close. All that matters is, did, is this middle candle right here is the absolute low of that middle candle lower than the one on the left and the right. It is, that's a swing low. Swing high, is the middle candle higher than the one on the left and the right? It is, that's a swing high. Okay, it does not matter if this candle closed red. It does not matter if this candle was green. What matters is, is the absolute high of this candle, is the absolute high higher than the one on the left and the right? It is, that's a swing high. Okay, now, what is an intermediate term swing high? And what is an intermediate term swing low? Really simple. So an intermediate term swing low is when you have a swing low with two higher swing lows on the left and the right. Okay? This right here is an intermediate term swing low. Look at my cursor. This right here is an intermediate term swing low. Where is the swing low, the higher swing low to the left? It's right here. See that? Swing low. Lowest low in the middle, two higher lows on the left and the right. It's higher than this lower swing low right here. See that? It's higher, and then you got another one on the right, right here. Boom. So that makes this an intermediate term swing low. You got a lower price swing with two higher swing lows on the left and the right. That makes that an intermediate term swing low. This right here is an intermediate term swing high. Why is it an intermediate term swing high? Because you have a lower swing high on the left and you have a lower swing high on the right. That makes that an intermediate term swing high. And this is not an intermediate term swing high. Why is it not an intermediate term swing high? Because it does not have a lower swing high to the left of it, to the left and the right of it. It's a swing high. It still is. You got your highs down the middle, two lower highs on the left and the right. But contrast the difference between this this swing point and this swing point. This one has a lower swing high on the left, a lower swing high on the right. This one does not have that. It's a swing high, but it's not an intermediate term swing high. Okay? Same with this. It's a swing low, but it's not an intermediate term swing low. Why is it not? Because it does not have a higher swing low on the left and the right of it. It's a swing low, but it's not an intermediate term swing low, okay? This is an intermediate term swing high. Why is it an intermediate term swing high? A lower swing high on the left, a lower swing high on the right. Intermediate term swing high. So I just wanted to make a quick video on that. It's just a really, really simple concept, but um, I know a lot of beginners may struggle with the difference between the two. So hopefully this video cleared that up for you. If it did, make sure you like the video. If it didn't clear it up, make sure you at least leave a dislike on the video and subscribe to the channel, turn on notifications so you don't miss an upload. And yeah, and if you're not a part of my free Discord chat room, I will have a link to that in the video description. If you wanna join the 1% Club, it is my premium chat room. Um, Then that's a link in the video description as well. And yep, so I will see you later.